Hi, I'm Madison and welcome to The How. So, we all know about the drought, that excuse for sandy lawns and shorter showers, but while we Californians can't water our lawns under beneficial water restrictions, apparently it's a different story for water parks. Since 2002, California's water supply has been facing nothing but drainage, a trend that is paired with drought. Today, water uses can cost you a hefty penalty if wasted. Fellow Californians have been stripped down to the bare minimum in terms of water use, so certainly water parks will contribute to the conversation efforts as well. That is wrong, but while some may ignore the issues at hand, we ask questions. You've seen the impact that the drought has had on your life. How have you adapted from this, from the business side of things? Well, terrible things have happened due to these California regulations. First of these, two of our slides cut because Apparently, they didn't follow with proper regulation. Second, hire some of our workers, meaning that we had less jobs to provide. And I'm sure that some of these workers are now homeless on the streets in, I don't know, San Francisco. And that place is ugly. And finally, I keep hearing how our park guests come to our park and talk, and talk about how they missed the fire slide because they say the fire slide is their favorite slide. And we had to cut that slide because of California state regulations. And honestly, that just makes me very angry. So overall, it's been going terrible. Our profits are still higher than every other water park in the country. I've heard your water company uses at least 9,000 gallons of water per day. Has your company done anything to change that? Well, 9,000 gallons of water a day? That's actually not a lot. In fact, let me show you something. Imagine this thing full, this thing all the way up to the cap, and let's say this thing represents all the water available in California. With 9,000 gallons, you are barely around here, and that is super close to the cap. So in reality, when we're using 9,000 gallons of water, we're barely using any water. And the people telling otherwise, the people in Sacramento, I think you know who those people are. I bet these people... Go on with your next question, please. You're saying that you haven't changed at all since the drought. Are you acknowledging this problem at all? Well, first of all, I even acknowledged this problem earlier by mentioning how we had to cut two of our water slides that were really popular with our guests. And we had to cut back on jobs because of the liberals, these liberals, who have been doing nothing but oppressing us. They're helping people who do nothing who do nothing and exploit the system. So yeah, I have peas to an evil system. But I have to thank you though. Mr. Goldman has proven what little legitimacy water parks have and why they use so much water. Though there is sadly only one solution. As water parks are lobbying our politicians as we speak, we must be active citizens and demand change. Water parks have proven themselves as nothing but leeches to our serious water crisis. Yet, they're acting like everything's fine and fun and continue to use our water. But the reality is, our water is drying up. We're not in Michigan or something. And they continue to suck. They're just acting like leeches. So when you think that it's all fine and fun to go splashing around on a hot day, think about it. We live in a damn desert.